What? <laughs> what? My name? Would you please it, say and Puddin, spell your name? It's Puddin Tame. Ask me again and I'll tell you the same. <laughs> no, I can't spell that. Uh, Larry. L-A-R-R-Y. <laughs> Ziggler. Z-I-G-L-A-R. And Larry, what's your occupation? My, my <laughs> occupation it used to be I uh, do home repair work. And who's your uh, who's your uh, most common who's customer? Who's my daddy? Uh, I can't answer that. <laughs> it might embarrass you. Uh, pardon? Uh, your most common customer. My most common <coughs> customer would I would say it would have to be students. They're a little rough on uh, their residences, so. Continue. Where's what's uh, what's your art doing? Oh my! Art what's going on here? Just, uh, I don't know. It's just uh, I, I, I'll leave it to you to describe it if you wish. It's just uh, different uh, materials that I work with. Oh yeah, I forgot. I was as I was describing earlier. I do work with glass, wood, metal, different different items. Anything I not anything I find. Just what? certain things I find. Could you show us your uh, favorite piece and describe it? My favorite piece. I don't know. I kind of like this one a lot. I kind of like that one because it's kind of different. And this one is kind of like, I, I'm going to try to figure out some kind of a, make it into more of a religious symbol. It looks like, uh, you know, some form of a, you know, could be crucifix. X. I wasn't always a handyman, so. so I did it, I moved to Mexico. I quit my job. I, was, I worked for interior designers. I did metal work year, a long time ago, oh. 20 years ago in San Francisco. And so I met a, a young lady. <laughs> no, she said she was, she was a, a Mexicana from Mexico. She said she was a millionaire. And so was I she? immediately, yes, she was. But w when we were down there, the, there, was a, there was a little problem with that because uh, beer costs 3,000 pesos. Public figure in any way? Uh, I dare say no. I don't think so. I'm pretty popular in my job, though. I have fan clubs. So you have <laughs> quite the following around town. It seems to be. Yeah. <laughs> it seems to be. And some of the students, uh, because of different companies, I dealt with some. I worked for some smaller companies where I handled actually the management, and some of them. You, I don't know. <coughs> you dealt some of the property management people skills aren't very good, and so. <laughs> They were just very good, and so they would just let me deal with the with the students. And so some of these students are like on their fifth year. I seem like they're my kids, you know. Oh. So I've known them forever. And then I'll bump into them at Lowe's, or so I'll have them work world work at Lowe's or Home Depot and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then they'll know what's up with some of the others that I don't see anymore. And I just like I was just telling you the other day about Muriel. Mm. Like a student, these they seem like my kid. The kids, I always tell them too. Like, you remind me of the daughter I never had. And they get all like, oh, and I go, thank God. <laughs> 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 but it does. It's, it's a joke. They're so expensive. But uh, yeah, that's new right here. I just did that about a week ago, and that's uh, got a poem attached to it. You want me to read it? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Well, if I read it, then you have to wear the helmet you always wear that you when you come over here, Trevor. <laughs> this is what Trevor always oh wants to wear. Oh my gosh, so scary. No, I don't know why he likes this so much. I'll put it on, but I Trevor's the one that Chuck. wears it. I know. Chucky loves I'll let you. you. I'll let you wear my hat. <laughs> <laughs> no, wear your hat and sing your poem. No, come no. on, Larry, please. No. The half sun on cold night sky sparkles through crush pots. Echoes dreamed. Is that it? That's, a, that's almost a long haiku. That is. Those things remind me of cones. After I did, I think it kind of might take so much time to do But that's just how things go. And uh, let's see. This. This is uh, some of the new, that's new right here. I just did that about, you know. I hate that term anyhow. But, but you don't like the term handyman? 
No, it just sounds kind of weird. I don't know why, what I don't like about it. But I wasn't always a handyman, so. I did it. I moved to Mexico. I quit my job.